okay well you know we're not we're not big gamblers so we just came down here because we like this casino a little bit and I don't know we walked out $80 ahead or 160 ahead we just played a little bit of slots Mike played a little bit of cards played a little bit but we're not big gamblers so we, we just want to spend our last night playing a little bit tomorrow's a big day we moved to Reno we know tomorrow, so early night. We had our little bit of whatever here. We're leaving Vegas today. Start our next journey. Check it out. Check it out. Okay. You ready, Mike? A red eye. We got 400 miles to do. No. And we ain't stopped until we get there. Really? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, we're on our way. Sophie's in her position. Well, we're still not. Oh, yeah. Still not out he's of. Got, he's got a truck's bumper on the front of his car. Yeah. It was a car wreck, so we've been crawling through. Crawling through town. Or pulling through on the freeway. <laughs> so we're still in Vegas been starting to move a little bit better now but yeah we're making it we made it out of the traffic now look at the road much better right look at the mountains and some more Joshua trees out here too this is a plateau Indian reservation yeah See a little bit of snow up in the mountain up there? Yeah, see a little bit of snow up there. Yeah. yeah. That's something I'd like to see. No. <laughs> no. Well. Out in the Nevada desert, there's a cat house. <laughs> Alien cat house brothel. There you go, huh? Okay. Area 51, Alien Center. I wonder if it's safe to go in there and use the bathroom. I don't know. That's kind of a cool little... I don't even know what the town is. I don't know. If I find out, I'll let you know. I think we're on top of the mountains. We've been kind of slow climbing. It's not bad. We're, at, um, we're in Death Valley. It's kind of pretty up here on top of the mountains. <laughs> Forest of Joshua trees. Yep. Yeah. And it's still, I don't think it's as warm as it was in Vegas, but it's still not, it's not cold or anything. But, yeah, it's not showing you what it looked like on top of the mountains we've been climbing. We're about halfway there, so, yeah, we're making it. Well, we're in the town of Goldfield, headed towards Reno. Thought we'd stop and take a picture of this old stuff they got right here. Got a lot of old buildings around here. A lot of old shacks. I just thought it was kind of cool. Almost to Hawthorne. It's been kind of a nice drive. The couple passes we went over, but pretty much it's roads weren't crowded. A lot of just straight, flat, flat land. It was, it was a pretty nice drive from Vegas to here. So we got about like 97 more miles to go where we're going. But uh, we're almost to Hawthorne now. It's, it's kind of pretty how it's nestled below those mountains right there. Hawthorne. Hawthorne Division Keyport. NUWC Detachment. Yeah, see, this is this is part of Keyport, the naval base in Bremerton. They have a, a little bit of a base here. Yeah, we had to go through there. Yeah, I had to go to that gate. Mike worked here years ago for three weeks, and I came with him. That's back before he retired. And uh, it was like a nice little vacation for me. This is uh, Walker Lake. When you leave Hawthorne, just right past Hawthorne, this lake. It's kind of pretty right here, and then you got the mountains as the backdrop. It's pretty. What do you think, Mike? 
How you doing? I think we'll stop and take a dip. Okay. <laughs> Maybe not. It might be a little chilly. It's not it's not as warm as it was in Vegas or Arizona. It's still okay though, and we're not freezing, but look how cloudy it is. Because look at here. We got snow on the mountain. Right? Yeah. <laughs> see see the snow on the mountains? Snow in the mountains and clouds. Okay, so yeah, we're getting closer to home as you can see. Oh, so we're almost there. Actually where we're going is to visit Mike's mom. Oh, Mike's mom for a couple days. But where does your mom live? She lives in Silver Springs, Nevada. Yeah. So uh, we thought we were lost for a while, but I think I think we're on the right road now. It's like we're making it. And you know what? We're starting to see trees again. We? You got a mouse in your pocket? I didn't think we were lost. I I thought. Did you see the trees? There's trees. Yep. I thought maybe we might have to just find some place to pull over and find some place to sleep. <laughs> GPS detoured us, a little detour. I guess GPS thought it was faster. I don't know. But anyhow. Anyhow, we're back on track. We should be there in half an hour. And uh, I'm, I'm going to be there for two or three days. And then back let's, on the road again. Let's see. So... So it's going to be like 499 miles, almost, I might say 500 miles, and uh, that we've gone? Nine hours. You think we did pretty good? We did 500 miles? We will. Oh my gosh. <laughs> we usually like to do 300 miles a day, but uh, yeah, it's been kind of a long day, but it, it's, it's all good. That much closer to home, right? Okay, I'll let you know when we get there. So, we're in Silver Springs, okay. Nevada. Here comes Mike. Get ready to go to dinner. We're staying at his mom's house. <coughs> got quite a bit of property here. Nice garage, too. We got full hookup. Yeah. Not bad.
shoulders. Springs this morning. That's Mike's mom's house. It's over by Reno. And uh, we're in California now, headed towards Susanville, will be the next stop. 55 miles an hour on the trailer. Yeah. Mike's not liking the 55 miles an hour, but I like it to sit here and relax. It's okay with me. But um, yeah, we're starting to see some trees now. I haven't seen any trees in a long time. Not that I missed them, but you know. Oh yeah, 55 miles to Susanville. We're not sure exactly what the name of this lake is, but we saw a line, uh, a sign for a Honey RV Park, or Honey Lake RV Park. So maybe this is Honey Lake. I'll see if I can find out later. But I'm telling you, it's huge. We've been going for miles and miles this lake has been here. Looks pretty muddy, but it's probably nice in the summertime. I don't know. It's just kind of a nice little valley that we're driving through. It's got, you know, hillside. And then this lake over here on this side. Looks like we might be coming to the end of the lake, but it's been miles. But yeah, it's a pretty nice drive through here. Yeah, it is. You know, we're still in California, but it just looks like, it looks like home territory because, you know, we're back in the trees again. Water and trees, that's something that we haven't seen in a long time. Yeah, we just passed Coy Flats Reservoir on the other side of Susanville, headed towards Redding. We have yeah. our 97 miles, go through the mountains to get to Redding. Five headed south, north. Yep. We're going to stop at Weed for the evening and do some eBay work. And I lost the, when I put the can, uh, my totes in the back of the truck, I wasn't paying attention. And then I pushed the window out of the canopy <laughs> between the cab and the canopy. And then the window fell down between the box and the, and the cab and sitting on the ledge. It ain't going nowhere. So we're going to have to tape that off. And then when we get home, we have to slide the canopy back and try to get that window back in. Fun times. <laughs> so, we, we did something different this time on the road. We left our uh, stores open. We just changed our handling time to, I think, three days is what we did. But we're still shipping as, as quick as we can, you know, but not like if you're at home base someplace. So, usually we put our stores on vacation when we're traveling like this. I got two sales today. Yeah? I've been selling on the road, so... Driving down the road, getting that cha-ching, making money as we're driving, so... Yeah, it's working out so far okay. 